I've just been diagnosed with hypothyroidism, but I don't fully understand what this means. Hypothyroidism is when your thyroid gland produces too much thyroid hormones. This speeds up your body's metabolism, which is why you're feeling jittery and tired. What's the thyroid gland? Your thyroid is a small butterfly-shaped gland in your neck. It produces two thyroid hormones, triiodothyronine or T3 and thyroxine T4. These thyroid hormones help your body use energy, stay warm, keep your brain, heart, muscles and other organs working as they should. But why does this happen? The most common cause is Graves' disease, an autoimmune disorder where your immune system mistakenly attacks the thyroid, causing this to produce too much hormones. Other causes include thyroid nodules and inflammations of the thyroid, nosep, thyroiditis, or too much iodine in your body, thyroid cancer, and medications like lithium and amiodarone. What are the usual symptoms? I thought being tired all the time meant I was low on hormones. That's a common confusion. While hypothyroidism causes fatigue due to low hormone levels, hyperthyroidism can also make you feel tired, but for different reasons. Symptoms include unintended weight loss, nervous, anxious, moody, weak or tired, tremors, racing heart rate, breathing problems, feeling hot and sweaty, loose, more frequent bowel movements, skin rashes, hair thinning, trouble sleeping, a swollen thyroid gland, lighter or no menstrual periods and vision problem especially with Graves' disease. So how is this treated? There are several treatment options depending on your health and severity and the cause. These include number one, medications like cabimazoles help to reduce the amount of thyroid hormones produced by your thyroid gland. It works best if your symptoms are mild. Two, radioactive iodine therapy involves taking a drink or swallowing a capsule that contains radioactive iodine, which shrinks the thyroid glands over time. Number three, in some cases, surgeries may be recommended to remove part or all of your thyroid gland. Are there any risk or complications I should be worried about? If hyperthyroidism go untreated for a long period of time, this may lead to severe complications such as heart problems, eye problems, brittle bones, thyroid storm, which is a rare but life-threatening condition. That's a lot to process, but I'm glad to know more. What should I do next? We'll work closely with your endocrinologist. You're likely to start with blood tests every few weeks to monitor your hormones levels. Make sure to take medications exactly as prescribed and let us know if you notice any changes. That was so helpful. Follow us in the notes to learn more about your health.